Sonic on Friends in... This is going to ruin my reputation. I am Jimmy Five and this here is my hair. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. What a spiky hair. I am Jimmy Five and this... What's up? Aww. I can't believe the water just stopped right at the best part of my song. Come on now, I have to go and fix this now? This happens to me all the time. The man in the house has to go fix everything. Hey, Mom! What's wrong? We have no water! Yes, we do! I'm outside at the garden watering the plants. So something happened to the shower! So get a towel and get out of the bathroom. But I haven't finished washing my beautiful hair yet. Your dad can fix it. But you will not be home until later tonight. Okay, then! Uh, so what can I do? Dad is only going to be home later on at night. There's got to be some other way for me to wash my hair. Maybe I could wash my hair in... Ah, uh, please, there's no way, man. Not even I would be so crazy to do something like that. <laughs> Not if I can use a sink to wash my hair. That's it. I just have to place the little stool over here, open the hot water faucet, and... <laughs> now I just have to place my beautiful hair under the one in water, just like this. Ouch, ouch! What just happened? Monica? Is that you, Monica? No way, Mr. Ostrich, sir. It's me. It's Smudge. My ball ended up in here. I didn't mean to. Sorry, man. I'm just going to take it and I'll leave, okay? Smudge! It's me, Jimmy Five. What? Jimmy Five? Is that really you in there? Yeah. Why? I don't know. You just look so strange. You look like, well, you look like, uh, the... I don't know. Ah! No, you moron! You hit me with that ball of yours, and now my head's hmm? stuck in here! <laughs> now that's really funny. <laughs> just wait a sec. Don't go anywhere. I'll be back in a minute. What? What do you mean? Come back here! Where are you going? I'm gonna call everybody to come see this. It's not every day that we can. Are you out of your mind? Do you want to ruin my reputation? Reputation? <laughs> what reputation? Do you really think that you have some kind of reputation? Right now, your reputation doesn't look that great. Will you stop making fun of me and help me get out of here? Okay, okay. But we could make a lot of money if we were to sell tickets so that people could come see you like this. <laughs> ouch! Ow! 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 You're not even budging at all, Jimmy Fry. Yes, I am. Can't you see? My head's moving right out of my body. Of course I'm now budging! Smudge, are you gonna leave me in here stuck like this? Or are you gonna help me get out of here? Um, um, just wait a sec. Ah! Hey, Monica! Jimmy Five just told me that you're fatter than a piggy! And that you could come in here and hit him if you wanted. <laughs> he what? I what? Train, so don't even hey, try Monica, it. It's not what you think. Get out of there, Jimmy Five. Get out of there so I can what beat you, you up. Doing? Oh, stop being such a chicken, Jimmy Five. Oh, I'm going help. to show you who's help. fatter than a piggy. Oh, 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 really oh, stuck oh, in oh, there. Hey, Monica, look, to be honest, Jimmy Five didn't really say anything about you at all. Nope. <laughs> I just said all of that so you can help the poor guy get out of the sink. Huh? Am I still alive? Oh, I'm still alive. Oh, thank goodness. Oh, so that's what it was? Wow, Jimmy Five. I've never seen anyone so lucky in my life. <laughs> it really is funny, isn't it? Hey, listen here, you two. Can you stop making fun of me and get me out of here once and for all? Oh, sounds like the ostrich boy's getting angry. <laughs> listen, I have an idea, and it's perfect for solving this problem. You do? You do? First of all, we need to go to Franklin's laboratory quickly and ask him to refill that shrinking machine he once made. Then, I'm going to go down the drain dressed as a mouse. 
Then from there, I'm going to take the magic flute like from the fairy tales and hypnotize all of the mice to assemble a rodent army. After that, we can go from bathroom to bathroom bringing messages of beauty, truth, love, and freedom. That is when I will be appointed by the town as the new Goodwill Ambassador of all the sewers. The whole world will never be the same again. Uh, Miss Ambassador, that's all very nice and sounds pretty cool, but aren't you forgetting about anything? <gasps> oh my goodness! Jimmy Five! I have to get him fast and push him out of the sink before the effect goes away! Uh, it was too late. Excuse me, but the two of you need to stop imagining all of that nonsense. That is never gonna work! Yeah, I think he's right. I could end up losing my position as ambassador with that kind of embarrassment. <laughs> and besides just getting stuck, now Jimmy Five would have to look at your fat face with those butts. <laughs> the only thing that could be worse than that would be getting stuck with a chupacabra. <laughs> Looking at you is even worse than that would be. <laughs> oh, Smudge! I will teach you a lesson you soon won't forget! I'm going to get you! Oh! Ah! Come back here! Guys, hey, is anybody out there? And that is how, during one of the most difficult operations operated this year, the first responders were finally able to help the boy Making who had boy his, head his head stuck, stuck inside of the bathroom sink for 15 air. hours. <laughs> Jimmy Five, come see! Don't you want to come see what you look like on TV? <laughs> uh, go fly a kite! Go! Monica and friends in! Get that for me? Whoa. Come back here, you little brat! I don't think so! If you don't stop, I will! <laughs> what do you think of my new hiding place? You didn't expect that, why? Just admit it, I'm a genius! I don't have any time for you or your foolishness! Look at where Samson landed! Aww, it looks like he got stuck in the tweet! But this is not just an ordinary tree! It's the first lemon tree of the lemon tree neighborhood. It's the tallest tree around here. What are we going to do? You? I don't know. But to celebrate, I'm going to do the dwarf quack dance. Uh, nang, 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 nang. Uh, Calm down, Monica. Why are you getting so angry? Because it's all your fault that Samson got stuck up there in the first place. If you hadn't dodged like a coward and just took your hit as you should have. What? It's your fault. You were the one who threw the bunny. Besides, I don't even care. It's your problem now. Jimmy Five, would you get it for me? Do you think you'll convince me with that silly face? Now you're just scaring me. Well, let's talk about advantages and benefits. What would be in it for me? Huh? Huh? I'll be forever thankful. Huh. And who's gonna guarantee that you just won't hit me again? I'll create an entire community on Checkbook just for you. I deleted my Checkbook account last month. It got bored. Well, then what do you want? Five days without being hit with the bunny. And will you be making fun of me a lot during that period? A whole lot. <laughs> ay, ay, ay. Let me think. Would I be able to use my large stuffed green elephant to hit you? Not your stuffed green elephant, not nothing. Mm. Five whole days, all five without hitting me. Take it or leave it. You better make up your mind quick. There's a woodpecker pecking away at Samson up there. What? Okay, okay. I'll do it, I'll do it. Please go and save him right away. Go. Ah, now that's what I like. A determined woman. But be very careful. I don't want you to get hurt. Okay? Me? I will get hurt? No way. Ah, this is a piece of cake. Uh, what do you want now? Ah, oh, you're going to damage my poor little bunny. If you're going to do it like that, then you can go ahead and stop. It's your call. Easier for me. Oh, I don't think so. You made a promise. Just try harder not to hurt the poor thing, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, all right. I got it. 
My goodness. This tree is very tall. I've climbed above the clouds. That's not a cloud. That's just some smoke from Sunny's dad's barbecue. Do you want another one? Ah, uh, I'll go get the bunny and get down from here quick. Aha! There it is. Uh-oh. I forgot all about the woodpecker. Ah! So, how'd it go? Did you get the bunny? Uh, I did. I told you that it was going to be easy. Ah! Put it away! Put it away! Oh! 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 Wowzers, I've never seen a bat hit someone like that before. Me neither. Oh. Well, here I go again. But this time, I want to see what else is in this twee. Ah, there it is. Below it, there's an angry woodpecker. Below that, the bat's family. A male owl. A beehive. A jaguar and... <gasps> Wait a sec, is that a twee or a zoo? Well, I need to come up with a plan to dodge those animals and... Ouch! Ouch! Oh, I... uh, hey, huh? what are you doing with that, huh? I just thought that you were a giant guava. But I'm not, so... In that case, can you check if there are any out there? The only guava oh. I see around here is the one inside of your head, which is also very small. Oh, my. This is a lemon tweed. There are no guavas up here. And where did Monica went after now? I'm here. I'm right here. Uh, what's the letter for? I brought it to help you get Samson much faster. And I'm sure you got that letter from Smudge's housewife. How did you know about that? Don't know. Just guessing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Mr. Antinor, what are you doing up there? Whoa, I was up here fixing the roof. <laughs> Trees don't have roofs, silly. <laughs> I meant the roof that's at my house. Uh oh. Huh? My goodness. Ouch. Monica, Monica. What now? I got your bunny. Really? How were you able to do that? Oh, it was easy. <laughs> I made a female owl doll so the male owl would fly away and hit the beehive, making that fall right on top of the jaguar's head. So then the bees must have stung the jaguar and it ran away? No. They all became friends and are playing dominoes right now on the other branch. All right, I get it. What now? Well, now I don't know how to get down from here. Wait a second, I have an idea. Don't go anywhere. Oh. Aha! Why didn't you tie the wolf to the branch? Oh, well, because it was so much easier to rope you. Where's my pretty bunny? Here it is. Oh, thank you so much. You're such a sweetheart. Oh. Oh. Whoa. Don't worry, we're right here. Oh. Well, that was lucky, huh? Thank goodness that you fell right into this rose bush. <gasps> thank goodness. This is a rose bush and it's full of thorns. What? Oh, not my prize-winning oh. roses. Oh, I'm gonna tell oh. your mother about this. Now, where are they hiding? Oh, oh wow, we barely escaped that one. I'm so happy that you're happy and you got your bunny back, but take a good look at me now. I'm all messed up. Oh, poor thing. You did all that just to help me with my request. You know what that is called? It's love. Aww. Yeah, that's why right. it's love. What? What's wrong, Monica? Did your bunny get stuck in the tree again? No, this time it's my boyfriend that's stuck up there. Uh-oh. Could you get it for me? Monica and friends in The Ring of Courage. Morning. Oh, Monica, what's up? Just look at that boy standing over there. It's Ricky. Oh, he's so handsome. Then why don't you go talk to him, silly? Oh, absolutely not, Maggie. I'm so shy that I can't even go anywhere near him. Well, then, you better get yourself some courage because he's walking over here right now. Oh. You know what? You're right. He actually is quite handsome, Monica. Monica? <laughs> Is he gone already? Will you please cut that out now? If you like that boy, then you should just go and talk to him. Uh, I can't do it. What if he laughs mm -hmm. at me? Or what mm -hmm. if I stutter? 
Mm -hmm. Ha! Dawn! Uh, uh, Hi, Monica! Uh, uh, um, no, I... It's just that I... I well... Mm -hmm. I, I, mm. <laughs> uh, well, how did it go? Oh, we were talking a lot, Maggie. He's a really great guy, in fact. Stop lying! I saw everything. You didn't even form a single sentence! Oh, but that's just because I'm so shy. <laughs> but he's just another boy, though. Oh, no, Maggie. He's <clears throat> not just another boy. He's a handsome boy. Oh, not this whole act again. Nope. Bye. Oh, but he's nothing like those weird, mean huh? boys who live around what? here. Huh? What do you mean by that, huh? What are you talking about, Jimmy Five? You know, I clearly had you talking to yourself about Wiki. Oh, Ricky, Ricky. I would do anything in the world to have the courage to talk to him. Huh? <laughs> Uh-oh. I recognize that look. Hey, Monica, I have the solution to your small huh? problem. Huh? What are you talking about? Well, now, what I'm talking about is the Wishing Fountain Fairy. What? And who is this fairy? A long, long time ago, when the knights ruled the world, there was a fountain that poured magic water. A magical fairy lived in that water. A fairy that could make any wish come true. Wow, what a beautiful story. But that's not all of it, though. Do you happen to know what was built over that old fountain? The fountain that's in our neighborhood? No, it's a pizzeria. But that's why the fairy moved over here, and now she's living in the fountain in our neighborhood. Oh, I'm going to go there right now and make a wish! <laughs> she really fell right into my twop. You see that, Smudge? <laughs> uh, hey, Smudge? And what are you going to ask for? Huh? Huh? A very hairy big possum. Oh, that's Hooray! magical. Magical. Oh, he's so thick, Skulls. Come back here, you idiot. Let hey, me tell hey, you a hey, few hey, things. Hey, hey. Over here. Oh, here it is. Yay! But where is this magic fairy? Fairy! Where are you hiding? Hey, Monica. That is not how you summon the wishing fountain fairy. No, you have to throw a coin in the water and then make a wish. Throw a coin in? Goodness, I didn't know that I would have to pay for it. Here it goes. I want Ricky to be my boyfriend. Only five cents? You're not gonna get anything with just five cents. Silent. Now what? Where is she? Is this fairy uh, coming or what? Uh, just wait here a second. Move over, you poor modals. For here comes a lemon tweed fairy. <laughs> The Wishing Fountain Fairy! Jimmy Five, stop! You've crossed the line this time! Do you think I could pass as a fairy? You couldn't at the very least make me a sorcerer or even a firefly, something like that! Quiet, Monica's right there! <laughs> what is this? I'm still waiting! Waiting for what? I just threw a coin into the magic fountain and now you owe me one wish! You threw a coin in? Mmm, I can make a real profit playing this game. Okay, let's see. Chilom, chilom, chilom. Snow, tell me now, what do you want? I wished for Ricky to be my boyfriend. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's a good one. Mm -hmm. I'm sorry, young lady, but I'm not here to perform miracles. <laughs> Say what? <laughs> Excuse me, Monica, I'll be right back. Oh, it's all good, Monica. I think I can make your wish come true. Hooray! Do you see this ring? I do. It's the Ring of Courage. If you wear it, it will let you have anyone you want as your boyfriend. Really? Yeah. Hooray! Thank you, fairy. Bye-bye! Hey, hey, wait a second. Hey, hey, hey. That ring is not free, you hear? What? I already paid. It's not like that. Well, I want your bunny in exchange for it, then. Bunny? What for? Well, to be honest, I don't really know. It's just that Jimmy Five told me to ask for it. Ah! Do we have a deal or not? Well, 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 okay then, fine. I did say that I would do anything to have the courage to talk to him, so... Amazing! I mean, besides, I can always just ask my dad for another bunny for huh? Christmas. Bye-bye now. The money is ours! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I yeah. am a genius! <laughs> and the best is yet to come! Oh, Monica's gonna be totally humiliated when she finally asks Wiki to go out with her. <laughs> He's gonna reject her big time, right? Yeah. <laughs> Ricky, huh? it's so great to see you. 
What's up, Monica? How would you like to go out with me to get some ice cream? <laughs> cool, I was just thinking right. about that. Oh, that's awesome. And maybe later we can go out for a walk around the park and... Hey, Smudge, did you just see that? Well, it seems like the Ring of Courage really worked out for her. Uh, there's no Ring of Courage. I made it up. It's nothing more than a cheap gift that you get whenever you buy a pack of gum, Smudge. There's nothing magical about it at all. No? Hey, listen here, you two, and get a hold of yourselves. You need to behave. What now? Are you saying that this ring didn't make me any braver at all? Not even a little bit. Oh, my God. I'm so embarrassed. I'm never going to be able to look at its face again. Never again. Uh... <laughs> Did you see the looks on both of their faces? <laughs> Smudge, what is it? Hey, what's the problem? Wait a second, Smudge. Wait, what? You're Cupid? Yeah, and there's someone here who wants to talk to you and give you something very important. <laughs> oh. Monica and friends in Skating on Wax. Your whole house using cooking oil. 
Oh, I don't believe it. And now what? How are we going to move around? Here we go. Now here's what we're going to do. We have to try to get that door. Everybody, let's go. Everyone take a hold of each other's hand. And now everybody stand up. Everybody ready? I'm ready to fall back down, that's for sure. There's many people. Meanwhile, Captain Awesome faces the magic pump. Take this, and this, and this one, and that. Take this, and this, and this one. Ooh, that's so gross. What is that awful smell? I'm coming, I'm coming. Maybe a sewage pipe is somewhere nearby. Let's see. Hi, Jimmy, how are you? Oh, I should have known it was you. Hey, what's up? What do you want? Can I ask you for a big favor? If you want to borrow my comic books again, you can't forget it. The last time that I let you, you ruined them all. And then... No, 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 no. That's not it at all. Ta-da! Oh, Chovy, hey! So, here's the deal. My parents and I are going on vacation today, and I'd like you to take care of him until I come back. It's just one week. I don't know, Smudge. I don't know if my mom would like that. I've never taken care of a pig before. Don't you worry about it at all. Look, taking care of Shelby is very easy. He's a well-behaved pig. He'll be no trouble at all. He doesn't eat a lot, does laundry, the dishes, and sweeps the floors. And he can make cheese sandwiches as well. Well, if you say so, then I would be able to take care of him. Thank you, Jimmy Five. I'll owe you one in return, all right? Bye, Shelby buddy. I'll see you next week. That's right, little Shelby. I'm going to be the one taking care of you for now. <laughs> I guess it can't be that hard taking care of a little small piggy. 
After all, I've even taken care of my baby sister, Mary Angela. No, no, honey. You're not allowed to eat people's cookies. No. <laughs> you can't eat this, Shovey. These cookies might end up making you feel really sick. Let's go to the kitchen, and I'll get you something tasty to eat. Although, I have to admit, I have no idea what a little piggy can eat. Oh, I know most pigs like to be in the mud. Uh. <gasps> oh, look! There's some chocolate ice cream in here. I bet you won't even notice the difference. <laughs> Son, what is Shovey doing huh? here inside of our house? Oh, hi, Mom. It's just that Smudge has gone away on vacation and he asked me to take care of Shovey. Can I please? He's so cute and I've always wanted to take care of him. Please, can I please? Hmm. Only if you clean up all that mess he's making in the kitchen. Oh. Huh? Shovey, no! Me and my big fat mouth. Huh. Gee whiz, I'm finally done. And you, little Shovey, you better not get into any more trouble, eh? Uh, what, what? Little Shovey? Little Shovey? What did that little piggy get himself into now? What do you think you're doing, you pig? Come back here! I'm gonna lock you up in this bathroom right this second! That way you can't mess anything else up while I clean the living room. I'm gonna make Smudge pay for this. Yeah, he's gonna pay for this, all white. Oh, I think that I'm done. I just hope that the little piggy has thought about and learned his lesson. Very well, Mr. Shelby. I'm gonna let you out now. But no more making such... Oh my gosh, where did the pig go? No way. He wouldn't dare go back in there. Oh. Come back here, you little Kremlin! You filthy creature! Oh. I think I must have the wrong house. Shelby, hi! Come here, buddy. <laughs> How you been? Huh? <laughs> Did they treat you well? And me? Are you not gonna ask how I'm doing? Do I know who you are? It's me, Jimmy Five, you idiot! You're Jimmy Five? Bro, you look really awful, but what happened to you, man? What happened to me? What happened to me? That crazy pig happened to me! How can you even stand keeping him inside of the house, huh? Hmm, inside of the house? Are you crazy? He's not even allowed to look past the backyard door! <laughs> Are you serious? My mom would have let him inside the house if you paid her! <laughs> That's so funny! Can you see Shovey inside the house? Have you seen the mess he makes in the living room, in the kitchen, in the bathroom, in the... <laughs> well, I'll be going now! Bye-bye! Coming, coming! Hey, you look better. What's happening? Nothing much, you know. It's just that after how it went last week, my dad thinks that we deserve a rest. And he decided to take a few days off, you know. Oh, I see. And you want me to take care of your little Fluff, right? Not even a problem. Just leave it to me. Actually, the thing is that Fluff is going to come with us. You will be taking care of Anthony and Amadeus. A Anthony? Amadeus? Who could those two be? Oh, they're just my sweet, small, pet-jumping acrobatic fish. Oh, what? 
pet fish in a bowl of water? No way, bro. Oh, <laughs> wow. That's way this again. I just knew that I could count on you. Oh, and try not to forget to change the water every day, okay? <laughs> Jimmy Five, no, no, no. Take these wet, slimy things away from me. Help me, Jimmy Five. Monica and friends in the haunted washing machine. Five. How many times have I told you that young children are not supposed to watch these horror movies? What are you saying about a horror movie? We're not, Mom. We're only watching the news and the weather forecast. Forecast? And why this much scream so loud? Because they said it was gonna rain for the whole week, and it will get worse. Ah, it's the end of time! It's the apocalypse! The world will be consumed by water! Ah! Calm down! Much. The rain is outside. There's no way it can get you wet in here. Yes, it can. Did you forget that the house has leaks all over? <laughs> Jimmy, fine. How can you be so cruel, son? <laughs> That's enough, you two. Everyone go straight to bed. But, Mom, it's still so early. No, it's not. And I don't want to hear a peep anymore. See what you've done now? Me? You were the one that was making fun of me out there. Ah, because you are way too sensitive. Hey, you know what? I am. So, just the thought of water, oh, it gives me such a chill, and then I start to tremble. All right, all right. I have to let me sleep, because we have to wake up early tomorrow. Oh. Hmm? Oh. Oh. Hey, what is it now, Smudge? Uh, I'm thirsty. Well. Go and get yourself a glass of water then, man. No, I'm too afraid to get close to the faucet. I can't believe it. That's a new one. Listen, Jimmy Five, my great adventure buddy, my faithful companion, my beloved brother, could you please bring me a glass of water? Huh? 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 I better get going. Otherwise, you won't let me sleep at all tonight. But be very careful with all the leaks around the house, okay? My goodness. Next time, I'm going to invite Sonny to sleep over. Oh, are you still awake this late, my son? Yeah, I have to get smudge a glass of water. What about you? I'm just finishing up the laundry, and then I'll go straight to sleep. Ah, that's cool. Then good night to you too, Mom. Good night, son. Smudge, uh... here's your water. Wow, thank you so much. You're the bestest friend, man. Oh, wait a second. Where's the straw to drink from? Huh? Oh, do you really think that I would dare put my dry mouth anywhere near this wet glass? Hold on. Calm down, my man, or you might end up spilling the water on me and... Oh, you know what? I'll go get the straw myself. <laughs> wow, it's so dark in here. I didn't know that Jimmy Five lived in a house that was so frightening. Uh -huh. I hope I don't come across any of the leaks. <laughs> hey, wait a sec. What's that strange noise? I think it's coming from inside the laundry room. <laughs> ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> all right, can you explain to me very calmly what all this fuss is about? Your mother's washing machine, it's, it, it's, it's haunted. It, it, it even tried to get me wet. So then I cried. And then I stopped because I know that tears are made of water and you know I don't want Will that. you please stop squamming? What are you talking about? What haunted washing machine? I'm trying to tell you that it's haunted. Just go look. I bet you there's a ghost inside of it, man. Oh, oh now you're just being silly, Smudge. Why would a ghost want to be inside my mother's washing machine? Well, taking a bath, of course. After all, ghosts are made out of bed sheets. Oh, my dear lord of video games and computers. Give me patience, please. Oh, look at it there. Well, it looked way scarier when I was in here earlier. Hmm? Maybe I was just hallucinating. <laughs> hey, do you hear that noise now? It sounds like a change that ghosts wear. <laughs> Stop acting like that. Look at that! Look at that! And I was attacking us with water! I told you so! I told you so! Whoa, that was way too close. Just another second and it would have drowned me. Don't exaggerate, Smudge. Stop it! It's just that the machine has a tiny little leak. We just need to close the little door here and... Ooh, Jimmy Five. 
Hey, buddy. Talk to me, man. Are you all right? Oh. Ah, he turned into a zombie. Ah, call an exorcist. <laughs> you are so silly, you baby. I was only trying to mess around with you. <laughs> oh, oh, Jimmy Five? Is that really you? Of course. I already told you. There's no Ugh. such thing as a haunted washing machine. Then you better tell that haunted machine hmm? because it's getting closer oh. to you. Oh. 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 What are we going to do? I know. I'm going to find some holy water. Holy water? That won't work. Huh? Do you think the haunted machine has enough water inside already? Then what are we going to do with it? Oh, let me try to think. What can defeat the supernatural? Hang in there. Jimmy Five! Ah! Huh? What's with all that screen? Whoa! What's going on out there? Oh, oh my God, it's my dry gallon. Uh, Quick, give me the garlic. Uh, oh, the cloth didn't work. Uh, 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 stop, uh, stop, there's no in it. Jimmy Five! Uh, I'm sorry, Mom. Uh, washing machine has been possessed. It's nothing like that, you two. It's probably just stuck mid-cycle again. All you have to do is restart it. Here, look. There it goes. All back to normal. Did you see? Oh. But, 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 but what about the ghostly chain noises? Oh, oh you two sillies. Oh, that's because I'm washing some pants that have some chains on them. Just huh? take a look. Oh. This washing machine is always giving me trouble. I'm going to call a technician to come and fix it tomorrow. Huh? Uh, so does that mean the machine's not haunted then? Haunted machine? <laughs> That's impossible. I knew it wasn't all along. No, you didn't. You were the one huh? who suggested we use the garlic. Uh, but, but it's... Let's go back to bed, uh. you boys. Everything is fine. All right, all right. Phew! Thank goodness the boys finally left! It seems like a ghost can't even take a quiet bath anymore! Bonnegan friends in... The foolproof ending of a foolproof plan! I'm sure my foolproof plan against Monica is finally gonna work. Genius. Brilliant. The most foolproof plan of the foolproof. <laughs> I just have to add something here, another something here, and... Oops. But Monica can't possibly know about it, nor should she suspect. Or she's gonna get me. Thank goodness that short fatty must be very far from here. Hello, Jimmy Five. May I ask what you're drawing down there? <laughs> uh, me? Oh, nothing. Uh, I'm just doing a little sunbathing here. Yeah, because the day is so great, isn't it? It's warm and sunny. But where's your bathing suit then? Isn't it too hot wearing all those clothes? Uh, uh no, 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 no. It's actually freezing. Just so dark and cool today, isn't it? <laughs> I think that you need to get out of the sun. Your brain is frying up inside your head. <sighs> that short fatty's always showing up at the most unlikely and inappropriate times. <laughs> She's gonna be really angry, infuriated. <laughs> when I put on my orangutan costume and I pull on that rope and release the quasi ostrich. <laughs> then she's gonna climb up a tree, then she's gonna climb up a tree and fall straight into the flying saucer up there. And then. So, Jimmy Five, have you already. Uh, da, 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 da. Everyone grab your laser swords, my fellow Jedi's. Hey, what in the world are you doing now? Well, it's very obvious. I'm pretending that I'm on Planet Wars. Can't you see my laser sword now? Wait a sec. 
I always thought that Smudge was the one who was a big fan of that Planet War stuff. Well then, Missy, you should know that I just adored the evil Doc Leda and Cookie Skywalker, Iodine, and especially Jimmy Jones. Oh, now you're just mixing everything up, aren't you, kiddo? And what you're holding is not a laser sword, it's huh? just a rolled up piece of paper. <laughs> uh, ah, I see that you have no imagination at all. Uh, what you're holding is not a laser sword. It's just a rolled up piece of paper. Nah, 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 nah. Uh, oh, what does she even want? Well, going back to my plan. Uh, oh, this is the part when she falls. Ah! Into a bathtub full of carnivorous worms. Ah! Are you still talking to ah! the ah! Uh, uh, uh. It's a Vuvuzela. But why are you going into this Venezuela? What Venezuela, huh? It's a Vuvuzela. It's it's a thing in the soccer matches. It's like all the quays, man. Oh, uh, why here, though? I'm sure there are no soccer matches nearby now. That short fatty always trying to stop me. Thank goodness my plan doesn't deteriorate easily. <laughs> Jimmy Five! Uh? Wowzers! Uh, Where did that cool kite come from? Uh, the, the, the kite? Do you like it? I made it just now. I just got the urge for flying a kite. <laughs> <laughs> I came over here to ask, why are you acting so strange today? But never mind now. I'm not going to say a thing. Whatever. Is or isn't this short fatty a big nuisance? Ugh. All right now. I have to whap this plan up once and for all. Because if Monica decides to come back again... Jimmy, oh, five, oh, five. Oh, oh. I'm a soldier, and soldiers have to march. I... The little boat goes, the little boat comes. Uh, I what? Oh, never mind then. Hmm, it's about time. Now, where was it that I left off again? Ah, of course. And then when she opens the makeup set, she'll come across a big snake. <laughs> Finally, my masterpiece is complete. The most full, 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 full plan! <laughs> I'm going to execute this great plan immediately. Oh, where is that short fatty? <laughs> oh man, I can't believe it. Now when I need to find Monica the most, that's when she's nowhere to be found. Hello, Jimmy Five! Monica? My goodness, how dare you! Do you want to scare me to death coming out of nowhere like that? Huh? Enough! No, get out! Get out of my sight before I start losing my mind and... Oh, all right, Mr. Cranky Pants. <laughs> I will not let her get in the way of my most foolproof of foolproof plan, okay? Uh-oh, wait up. Hey, Monica, wait a second. It was just a joke. <laughs> now it's my turn. <laughs> uh, what is all this? Oh, it's you, Jimmy Five. Oh, you. You. Why? I guess maybe my foolproof plan wasn't really foolproof after all. Why? Huh? Jimmy Five, can I play with, uh, with my plan? Sure. Hooray! <laughs> Woohoo! Where did it all go wrong? Oh my goodness. <laughs> <laughs>